Hi Capricorn, welcome to your reading. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please keep an open mind for general tarot readings on YouTube. Um, take only what you feel makes sense for your situation at this point in time, my loves. I hope all my Capricorns are doing well. Please look out for your bonus reading this week. Um, I will be coming out with a bonus reading for you. Happy birthday to my Cappies. Many blessings coming into the new year. Um, and I hope you enjoyed your new year and you guys are back in one piece. Okay. All right. So let's get into it for Capricorn. Anissa, close the door, baby. Okay, take it. But you can only get a little bit more. <laughs> it's my daughter, guys. All right. What is coming to Capricorn in love? Take a little bit and, and put the rest back, okay? What is coming to Capricorn and love Capricorn? Okay. Well, Capricorn, you have the Queen of Cups here. You could be dealing with a Cancer. Mm. And the Three of Swords reverse. All right, close the door, baby. What is coming to Capricorn and love Capricorn? So... I feel like Capricorn, nowadays, you kind of have somebody still watching you. You have somebody watching you. And um, do you remember anything I'm saying could be your energy or their energy? But I kind of feel like somebody's a little remorseful here for what they've done to somebody, okay? When are these freaks not remorseful? <laughs> well, if you would just not screw up the first time, then you wouldn't be in that situation, right? You could be dealing with a Cancer or um, an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. What is coming to Capricorn in love? So basically, Capricorn, this person, um, this person is probably, you know, someone is looking up the other person, um, you know, probably doing their research, trying to figure out, you know, what's going on in the other person's life. This person feel, you know, someone feels some kind of way. They still have feelings towards the other person at this point in time. That's just the truth, okay? Now, maybe this was a missed opportunity for X, Y, Z reason. Maybe for some of you, someone didn't truly screw you over or whatever. Maybe it was just, you know, something about the, their past that kind of caused you guys to miss out on each other, okay? What is coming to Capricorn in love? What is coming to Capricorn in love, Capricorn? So I feel like somebody really wants a chance here to try to, you know, um, make this right. You know, they want a chance to do right, to be, uh, to walk in a straight line, Capricorn. Um, and now I'm getting this energy of, can I trust this person? Can I trust that this person is going to walk in a straight line this time and do right? You know, can I trust that? Two of Cups is at the bottom of the deck, okay? We have Cancer, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. We have um, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy as well. So that's what I'm seeing, Capricorn. Um, I think someone is going to come in the situation towards the other person to try to maybe mend things with the other one. I mean, if you want to know if it's safe to take this person back, you know, guys, I have to tell you the truth. It does look safe. <laughs> it's safe to take this person back. Um, I mean, because it shows that this person does have a genuine intention to work um, on doing right, okay, to being, uh, to work on being committed or offering you a commitment, whatever the case may be, okay? Um, if this is a new person, because some of you could be dealing with a new person, you know, perhaps there's been some trust issues, some... Um, past issues lingering um however they are going to want to explore this with you because at the end of the day i do think this person regardless still loves and cares for you um they still feel very drawn to you i think you and this person could even be soulmates capricorn um so no matter what i see this person still trying to move towards something with you something serious something happy something passionate okay that's what they want okay now the way they may go about it with you is moving a little slowly they're a little methodical here but either way i think that um you know when you see the knight of coins there is an energy of someone feeling dedicated to the other person you know somebody willing to you know put the work in and um 
do as much as needed, take as much time needed, you know, um, to, to see results from this, good results from this Capricorn. And to top it off, we do have the Two of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So let's clarify this through a Swords Reverse. So yeah, it's either that, you know, someone hurt the other person. Um, I don't know. It's, it's, it's a general reading. I don't know how this person hurt you. The storyline may be different for each and every one of you. However, well, I meant the variations of the story will be different. However, um, at the end of the day, the same storyline applies. You have two knights here, knight of cups, knight of coins. This means that this person's really motivated, uh, Capricorn, really motivated to fix things with you or to be with you. Um, I do feel that Capricorn for sure. Okay. Some of you, it may be hard for you, you know, for, for someone to look back. Um, I mean, to kind of move on from what has happened, um, in the past. However, I do think that this could still be successful. Um, what is the five of cups for Capricorn? You have the star reverse, the will of fortune, and the chariot reverse. Someone can't stop thinking about how bad they screwed up or how bad the other person may have hurt them or whatever they did. So it's hard to really turn around and say, you know, all right, let me let me just forget about, not forget, but let me really truly forgive that, you know, and try to see past it. I mean, it's going to take some real proving to prove to someone that, okay, um, I can trust you and you've changed and you're going to be this or you're going to be that or, you know, I can trust you, period, if this is a new person, okay? So uh, someone's going to want less talk and more action. They're going to want to see the proof. Um, it's not going to, words are not going to be enough. <laughs> so this freak, uh, Capricorn, is spying. Someone is spying for sure. I do feel that um, because this person still feels very drawn to you. They still do want you, Capricorn. That's just the truth, okay? And they are looking at you as that person for them, Capricorn, okay? They are looking at you like that. So they know they would have to do a lot to, to show you that, you know, they mean business or whatever the case may be. They know that. Because they know to get you to open up or to get someone to open up again, it's going to be difficult. But it's something that they're willing to do because why? They genuinely do love and care for you, okay? Okay. Now, like I said, for those of you dealing with a new person, I can see, you know, somebody may have their own trust issues. However, I still see you guys moving towards uh, this Ten of Cups with each other. So things look to be pretty good. They still want to fight for this future that they that they see with you. Um, that's just the truth here. It could be a Virgo. What is the Seven of Coins for Capricorn? Six of Wands, wow, Four of Wands, my goodness. Page of Wands. I mean, I don't know what else to tell you, Capricorn. Okay, and I get that some of you could even be, maybe if this is a new love for some of you, um, this is a new person, you could be healing from your own disappointment. Maybe you recently suffered a loss, a disappointment, or something like that, and here this person comes in, you know, basically just changing the game up. <laughs> And it looks pretty good, guys. I do think this person could be your soulmate, okay, for sure. Um, and you're probably a little defensive on the on the fence, like, hmm, who, you know, who who sent you? Who are you? <laughs> what do you want from me coming in loving me and being all consistent and stuff? Who the freak are you? <laughs> okay, um, you have the nine of swords. So there, there could be some guilt if this is someone you have history with. There is guilt. Around, you know, someone has some guilt around what they did. Uh, they could be having sleepless nights, and now all they want to do is to, to walk in a straight line, Capricorn. Okay, that's why you may notice them watching you or something like that because they're getting ready to do this. Okay. Um, now, it may be hard for you to see this freak the same, okay, in another way. Now, um, like I said, this nine of swords could even be a good thing for my new loves out there because you're like, my goodness, this person is just, this person, I mean, we get along so well, it feels so right, and what the freak? <laughs> no, it is possible this could be, you know, uh, your person here, uh, Capricorn, okay? All right. 
hermit reverse yeah some of you could be coming out of time of you know solitude introspection you need to take some time for yourself or maybe they needed to or someone needed some time to really um think about what this connection meant and how they screwed it up okay so now after this thinking they're ready to they're ready to do this capricorn so just know that this is what's about to happen um so <laughs> this is actually really really beautiful and then you have temperance sagittarian energy okay sagittarian energy all right what do we need to see for capricorn in this situation i keep hearing i shouldn't have let you go i keep hearing that i don't know why um you have complicated complex and complicated capricorn all right capricorn so we have doubts and hidden desires so someone may have their doubts like i said if trust was broken in the past or something like that capricorn um this freak could even be having nightmares as to <laughs> look at how this freak look capricorn they could be having uh doubts uh someone could be having some fears sorry some nightmares on what they've done once again, we have real regrets. This freak is feeling regretful, Capricorn. Absolutely regretful. Okay. Um, some of you, this freak is a lost soul. And you have insomnia and sleepless nights. So this, this person's losing it. Absolutely losing it, Capricorn. Um, how did I let, I keep hearing, how did I let this person get away? How did I let this slip out my hands? How did I, you know, do, why did I do what I did? You know, what an idiot. <laughs> so let me have a soul contract with this person. Soul contract. All right, Capricorn. Um, some of you, this freak hurt you with a third party. Some of you, you've been working on self-love and independence, okay? Bottom of the deck, we have rumors and gossip. Hmm. So that is what we got, Capricorn. This freak is not sleeping too well. Um, not at all. Okay, Capricorn. I'm hearing someone also may have regrets for pushing the other person away with their trust issues. So here we go. Confirmation, trust issues keep me stuck. They can't find anyone like you. They say they compare others to you all the time. You trigger me and I run away, Capricorn. I'm ready to step up. Ooh, but yeah, if I can't forgive you. If this is someone who really screwed up, it may be really hard to forgive. <sighs> okay. Capricorn. Some of you, someone may have ended the relationship and they regret that. Okay. They say, I miss you so much. They want to know if you're still single. Someone may still be angry and upset. My daughter's getting some water, guys. I'm really sorry. I work from home, so it is what it is. <laughs> and, uh, you know, school has been out, but she will be going back to school tomorrow. So a bit of a distraction. Close your door, baby, okay? Okay. All right, Capricorn. Well, the cards have surely spoken, my love. Um, the cards have surely spoken my loves okay get ready because this is what they're about to do um, this is what they're about to do this is what someone's about to do somebody has some real regrets here Capricorn um, maybe with pushing the other person away or if they did do something crazy this freak is regretting it <laughs> Okay, and to be honest, now it's, it looks like they want commitment, Capricorn. That's what they want. They want a commitment. They want to do right. Um, let me pull some out of that. Either way, this is someone I feel wants commitment, okay? They say, please take me back. 
okay? You have never letting you go. What else for Capricorn? Trying to find the right words to say. It's probably taking this person quite some time to come around to saying this or whatever. Let me love you better. Capricorn. Illusions. Tell them your mind. This could be a Gemini. It could be a Taurus. Okay, what else for Capricorn? Crying over you. Sharing feelings. Regret my poor decision. Well, here they, here they come, Capricorn, baby. Here they come. <laughs> this freak will be coming around the mountain when they come. The freak is coming around the mountain when they come. They'll be coming around the mountain. They'll be coming around Capricorn Mountain. They'll be coming around the mountain when they come. All right, so that's what we have. I hope this reading gave you the clarity that you are seeking Capricorn. Thank you for tuning in, and I will talk to you guys soon.